So we are going to talk liquid eyeliner. So this is liquid eyeliner. It's our perfect liner um, with Limelight by Alcone. And I wanted to show you a couple different ways to do it. So I'll do one eye one way and the other eye the other way. So um, for me, if you notice, whenever I'm looking straight on at you, let's do that. I have a hooded eye, which means that my eyelid kind of droops. Um, so my, it, my liner looks a little bit different than somebody who doesn't have that little hood there, um, who has really tight, good re uh, reality here that they can go and kind of do whatever they want um, with their eyeshadow. So I kind of have to be careful with how I do my makeup. Otherwise, it disappears when I open my eyes. So I'll show you how I do it. Um, and of course, it differs per person uh, based on... If you don't have this hood, I'll kind of show you. You can do yours a little bit different. I just wing mine out a little bit different than most would. Um, so first, um, I start mid, mid eye as close to my lash line as possible. And some people, if you want whatever works for you, I pull mine taut. And then I do it that way. Okay. So as close to my lash line. Did that. So, if you wanted to end there and just go all the way over, you could totally end there. And that's that. And if you look, it just makes the base of your lashes fuller. That's, that's all I did. Okay? So, if you want to stop there, you can stop there. If you don't want to stop there and you want to do a little cat eye or a little wing, let me show you how to do that. So, um, again, I pull mine, actually, I look at mine first to see where I want to do it. And so if I just wanted to do that little wing right there, that's it. I could stop. So the only problem with that is because look, because I've got little hooded eyes, see what happens when I pull it? So when I open, it looks perfect. When I pull, so when I close my eyes, there's a little crease there, okay? So I'm just fixing the crease. Perfect. So if I wanted to stop there, I could, okay? If I wanted to get the whole cat eye look, then I'm gonna do one step further. So I went out, so you literally could take this and just lay it down. So watch, we'll do this one that way. This is how I'm gonna show you guys. So on the very corner of your eye, lay your pen down, okay? So that's your base. That's gonna give you the line mark that you need to follow, okay? So then you could go down into your eye. Follow that in, okay? And then from this end, my lashes are getting so long that I'm going to have to hold them out of the way. Okay, so that's more of a dramatic look. And I would just clean it up really good. Okay. I personally, this one is just too chunky. I already have those hooded eyes. It doesn't look good on me. Some people, if you have different eyes, great, go for it. It doesn't look good on me. So there's that. I have to do something different. So with this one... Okay, so I'm just going to pull the line in a little bit more. So I start outward. Go in. Okay. 
There's a little mess up there. This one's just a little bit thinner, but again, with the way that my eyes are, see how my, my lid's just falling right over that? I can't do that. I literally just do that little tiny, boop, almost like the Nike sign. So I've seen this done on people that they go out really, really far. Like seriously. Okay. You ready? I've seen that and then from that from that okay so from that major wing I'll tell you I'll show you how it works that well eyeshadows so let's just say we're gonna do it so then they take their darker color and they start at the base and fan out okay This is how people make this work. And it doesn't look so gaudy. And then you kind of want to go down here a little bit. So see how already it's like, oh, that kind of ties it all together. And then you just blend. You don't want it to look like real... Like you have one color here and then nothing here. Or one color here and one color here. You really want to blend it out because you already have this super dramatic eye. And it looks good. It really does. It just depends on what you're doing and how you want to look. Some people can totally pull this look off. Um, I keep it more simple and just do the one little... And that just makes your lashes look a little bit longer and fuller. So, there you go. I'm not crazy about this. Like I said, if when my eyes are closed, it looks different. And of course, trying to do a tutorial. It's not a simple, but I just see it because of my hooded eyes, it makes it look creased when I close when I open my eyes. So that this doesn't work. But if it works for you, great. This one looks great. I can open my eyes and it still looks decent. It still looks like a wing. Um, but I wouldn't do it this dramatic. So if you're going to do this, just make sure that you're kind of bringing, bringing your color out and over kind of along the, the wing and it just makes your eyes pop you guys. So let me know what you think.